Hey guys, so I just picked up a new license plate frame. Now I wouldn't really consider this a mod, so I'm not gonna call it that. I just, I'm blocking out so much stuff on this car and I got this gunmetal license plate frame and I like it. Um, it's a great quality. I think I spent like $28 for it, so it's not cheap. Um, but I saw a lot of you guys have like some black frames or carbon fiber frames. So I thought I'd go that route and get a black frame. I thought it would flow really good with the the black here, you know, and then I have the badges and then the, the um, diffuser here. So just picked this up from Amazon. It was $8 for two frames. They're just, um, they're um, powder coated black. So I'll go ahead and open those, show you guys what they look like. And I already have a black one on the front. Um, so I'm just gonna use one of those. You get it, it's a two pack. And it has really good reviews. So I figured for $8, I might give it a shot. So very subtle difference, I just think it'll, this is so much like the silver, it kind of blends right in. I think the black frame will kind of go with my black um, plates too. So I'll go ahead and switch that and show you guys what the black frame looks like. Okay guys, so here's what you get in the pack. You get all the hardware you need. I'm gonna use the existing screws I have because the threads are usually different with the ones they give you, but they give you the little retainer clips and then the black caps to match. And you get two frames here. And it's pretty thin on top, so it shouldn't block the registration sticker too much. Now, if, depending on what state you live in, they're going to be different. But I got the wide bottom to match the same one I have. I like that. Okay, so I'll go ahead and install that, and I'll show you guys what it looks like. And so here's the the um, gunmetal, and then and here's the final product, guys. Really nice, just very simple, nothing crazy, just. It's a matte black. There's a lot of fingerprints on it now, but um, just powder coated, stainless steel. I like how it looks. I mean, it's something so subtle. It's not like a huge thing, but I just, um, I like the gunmetal. If you had any other car, it'd probably look really good in like a modern steel, but it just looks so much like this. It's almost dead on. So I thought since I have this black and you know, all the badges and the smoke tail lights, why not just go with the theme? And I like it because it blends with uh, my personalized license plate too. So it's all black, very simple. Like I said, $8 for a two pack and it gives you all the stuff you need. So if you guys are looking for a inexpensive license plate frame, I would suggest this one. I'll put the link below, I got it from Amazon. Um, like I said, I like the quality of the other ones I got too, but it was like $28, it's not cheap. So I didn't want to really want to spend that much money. So just went this cheaper out. We'll see how long it lasts through the winter and stuff, but for eight bucks for two of them, I, mean, I can switch it with the other one if I want. So it's just a very subtle change, but I think it goes with the theme. So I hope everyone's doing good. And I appreciate the support once again. I like getting your guys' feedback, I really do. Um, and give me ideas for future videos, I'd appreciate it. And I will talk to you guys later, thanks.